Hello everyone, welcome to Vicar David's 60 Second Slot on this Tuesday the 23rd of March 2021, the anniversary of the first lockdown. And given that um, the pandemic has been with us and we've been locked down in various times in the past year, uh, and of all that's happened in this last 12 months, I thought the best response to this is a short time of prayer. So let us pray. Loving God, you hold all our times in your hands, our past, our present and our future. Be close to us now, as we remember all the difficulties and disappointments of the past year. Be especially close to all of us who are thinking of someone we loved and knew, but see no longer, whether family, friend, colleague or neighbour. Help us to trust that they are at peace with you and comfort us with your presence. Lord, in your mercy, hear our prayer. Loving God, you place us in families and communities, and we give you thanks for all those round us who serve us and help us in so many ways. Give wisdom to community leaders, to our schools, hospitals, care homes, and other agencies who make a difference to our lives. Help each of us to have the courage to reach out with thanks and kindness to those around us, to speak words of faith as we share the good news of your love. Lord, in your mercy, hear our prayer. Loving God, as we journey towards Easter, help us to live as people of hope, knowing that beyond the pain of the cross lies the joy of the resurrection. Inspire us in our worship, through our churches and in our homes, that we may bring, you, bring glory to you and joy to others. Be with those who are struggling in mind, body or spirit and give courage to those who are facing uncertainty and change ahead. Help each of us to keep our eyes fixed on you, that we may reflect your light to all whom we meet. Lord, in your mercy, hear our prayer. Lord Jesus Christ, when fear and anxiety besiege us, and hope is veiled in grief, hold us in your wounded hands and make your face to shine on us again, for you are our Lord and God. Merciful Father, accept these prayers for the sake of your Son, our Saviour Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. And now the peace of God, which passes all understanding, keep your hearts and minds in the knowledge and love of God and of his Son, Jesus Christ, our Lord, and the blessing of God Almighty, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit be with you and all whom you hold in your heart this day and forevermore. Amen. Thank you very much for watching and God bless you.